I think back to the time when my search was began. I look behind those shores of sand for the endless everlasting world out there. <laughs> No, I just realized those are the statues from stinking Mario World. I guess I just realized that because I played Mario World recently for the channel. Um, I like I'm blocking Peach's face, which is funny. I'm um, I noticed those statues are the ones from stinking Mario World that like shoot fire. Or do they sometimes shoot cannonballs? I don't know. I just remember that I was really angry that standing near them didn't make them stop shooting things at you. It was like the bullet bill blasters. I I assumed it would be like that, but no, apparently not. Which is very lame. But what ifs? Uh, but what? But what? What what? In the butt. But what? But. Ooh, T. But this is really stinking stupid. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, anything recently that happened? Um, there's like a lot of movies coming out that like I want to see, but I haven't had the chance to like see any of them. Uh, Crazy Rich Asians has been getting like a lot of uh praise lately, so I want to see that because I want to see what all the hubbub is about. And because it's also just super important to uh, support films like that because uh, the industry is not a very positive place of, as I have learned. So I need to be a good role model and ally in the industry that we all live in because we need to support everyone within it and stuff. Uh, let's see, just go down here. And it's the star over there though. Uh, no it isn't, so let's go down here. One, two, three. I could steal a star, but no one has one. How wonderful. Uh, he, welcome to the Boo House. It's Boo and Boo. Uh, so what do you want us to steal for you, you big fink? What? Okay, then. Sure. Steal coins from, uh, Luigi, because I like making fun of him. <laughs> so, what was I even talking about in movies I want to see? So, crazy, cra crazy Rich Asians, I can't speak. Um, that is a movie that we want to see. Uh, anything else that, right now? I'm weirded out about people saying Tea Titans go to the movies is actually good. Like, I'm sorry that I'm with the camera people who just like, I'm angry about it because like, I just wish it wasn't Teen Titans. Like, if it was actually good or funny, like, I don't like the humor to begin with. Uh, so it's not just solely the Teen Titans aspect that bothers me, it's just that I've seen episodes of it and I don't enjoy it. So I don't enjoy that type of humor in general, so I don't like it. Is the movie gonna be the same or is there like something extra about it that I and missing out on that I need to see? I have no idea. But, um, I do know about the secret ending to it, so, like, because everyone was talking about that, so I'm excited for that. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then I won't say anything, but that secret ending, though, looking forward to it. Um, I'm not sure if it's even in theater still. Uh, did I talk about the Christopher Robin? I feel like I did, so I need to repeat that. Um, I actually really want to see the Nun movie, because I missed out on seeing it in theaters, so I want to see a very scary movie in theaters and just, like, freak out with everyone because I haven't had that opportunity yet. Take a breather, new minigame. Oh, no, it is on the real in fish game, so area stuff. No one else cares but me. Take a deep breath and see who can stand underwater the longest. But it's not just an A tapping minigame, it's an L and R tapping minigame. Yeah, a completely different concept, except not really. Uh, but yeah, I just gotta press buttons as fast as you can and hope that uh, you breathe less often than everyone else. Uh... But yeah, um, what else is happening? Any other movies coming out? The Nun movie that I want to see? Uh, Happy Time Murders, like, wow, I really dominated this one. Exactly nine seconds. Um, I don't know what even that thing is. It, I remember when I saw it, the trailer for it in the Deadpool movie, my jaw just dropped 20 sinking feet to the ground. It was so sinking weird, like, how does that exist? Why does it exist? I don't understand why. But of course I'm gonna go see it because it intrigues me. Uh, question, is the Steven Universe movie coming out in theaters or is it just Cartoon Network? Cause like, if Teen- I'm sorry, but if Teen Titans Go deserves to be in the movie theaters, then Steven Steven Universe better get the same treatment, cause my god. Like there's- Like, I have no idea like, why- uh, Like all the stinking Cartoon Network movies over the years that like, Cartoon Network shows have had good movies over the years, like the Totally Spies one's really good, uh, Mucha Lucha was really good from what I remember. Like, just all these great shows that we all love, and then Teen Titans Go! that has so much controversy behind it, but it gets a theatrical release at the movies. I don't understand that. And, like, my god, I swear to god, if 
Steven Universe doesn't get a theatrical release, I'm gonna be stinking angry, because that is a movie that deserves it so stinking much. That show is legendary, oh my god. And, like, I was just thinking about it, how, like, when it first started out, it's- I really didn't like it, and Pink Boot disappears, so the bridges are gone, so we have less places to travel, but the locomotive is active, we'll get into that later. Um, but- when uh, Steven Universe first started, I really didn't like it because it was just like another obnoxious kid show about a stupid kid making stupid jokes and being really annoying and stuff. And I remember the first episode I saw, um, people are really gonna get mad at me for this, but it was the Giant Woman episode. And that song, people just were singing it constantly. I'm like, it's just so stupid. The song is stupid. The main character is annoying. The magical ladies are cool, but like you barely get to see them. So I just did not get what all the hubbub was about, but then like strong the stronger than you thing happened and I was just like, oh wait, this show is actually amazing and stuff. There's actually something going on here that I need to uh, experience and stuff. And I'm glad that I stuck with it and like when you think about it, it's sort of about like uh, growing up in childhood and stuff like that because yes, yeah, Steven's super obnoxious and stupid in the beginning, but then like he becomes involved in something so much greater and he needs to uh, step up to the occasion. He needs to change who he is and like it's just time in general is passing so he's changing as a person. I don't know if that was uh, her intention from the very beginning, Rebecca Sugar's intention, like if she planned this. Because I'm sure people enjoyed the show from the beginning, like there are people who are into that sort of humor and this sort of style of show. But then it evolves into something so much more and it's ingenious and like the fact that I don't like it from the beginning and then it gets better as time goes on, like it makes sense why I don't like it. It makes sense that he's presented in this way and it completely changes over time. Like. It's just such an ingenious show and you you owe it to yourself to watch it because like it's a piece of history that you need to experience as it's happening. And the locomotive's gone. Way to go, Luigi! Way to ruin everything for us. If we go the entire board without seeing the locomotive, I'm gonna be really singing angry because it's like my favorite thing with this board. This thing in Boo Tree of Awesomeness. Oh hey! Thanks for- Okay, I don't hate you completely, Luigi, because you made it so I could get the star very, very easily. <laughs> that was very convenient. And hey, I could actually activate the locomotive! Hooray! I don't even know if it's called that, but whatever. I got a star though, which is very nice. Of course I'm gonna win on the boo board. Me and boo, we're good old buddies. We're boo buddies. We go way back. We go way back. We're boo buddies. I don't think I know. Oh, that's very far away from where I am. Uh, let's see, do I get a mega mushroom? Nope, two minis. Double mini, all mini all the time. Uh, well, like I was even saying, so, uh, yeah, I really hope Steven Universe gets a theatrical release for its movie, because, like, it's, it's so important, and I feel like it should get a theatrical release, and, like, I would love to have it be considered for, like, an Oscar, because, like, do TV movies in general- no, I don't think they do, like, if it's on TV, then it doesn't count as, like, a movie, as weird as that sounds, but I really hope it gets shown in theaters, and, like, not just a miniature theater release, I hope it's, like, a movie that gets shown in theaters, like, just no questions about it, you could go to any theater and see it. Oh boy, Team Treasure Check, that's just been like such an impactful show in my life and in, in every, a lot of other people's lives, I could go on forever about it, but I'm sure you don't need to hear from me, because everyone else is talking about it. Uh, me and Wario, Team Yahoo! Yeah, that's a great team name, Team Yahoo! Yahoo! I just realized, the, no, I just realized those pictures of the Mario Party characters on the side, but Donkey Kong had a very funny pose, he was like, Ugh. Uh, let's see, speaking of Donkey Kong, um, very weird segue, but... I don't know why, the for Smash Ultimate, like, the graphics look amazing, all the characters look great and everything, but Donkey Kong is the- How does Wario already have his chest? Well, um, okay, I'm gonna go over there. Um, Donkey Kong's sprite in Smash Ultimate just looks really bad to me, I don't know why, but his is the only one that I have a problem with. It looks- the model just looks bad, the hair looks like it's all clumped together, it looks like a 3DS model blown up onto the uh, Switch, I almost said Wii U. Uh, I just don't understand it, and I- uh, wish they would, like, edit it a bit, because it looks crummy. His artwork, um, the, like, official artwork thing, that looks fine, but, like, just in-game, it looks really bad. It looks like a downgrade. I don't understand it. But whatever, it's just, like, a very minor thing. Donkey Kong's always the character that I play first, um, in every Smash Bros. game, because he was my first video game character, and he's grown up so much! I'm so happy for him. It was just really cool to see Donkey Kong in the spotlight of a Smash trailer, because, like, with King K. Rool being- Last five turns already? No! Only five turns left! Bear witness, then, to the last five turns event in all its glory. But wait, what about the lucky party ticket drawing? I almost forgot. Okay, here we go. Here's the drawing. Where's the left picture? Oh, what do I need? I need a warrior. Ah, unfortunately that didn't happen. E oh, right, no winners. Well, don't worry about it. My board is still the best. Yes, it is, Boo. 
And thus ends our little lucky party ticket drawing. Now let's check our players' standings. To first place, Daisy. Second place, Peach. Third place, Luigi. And dead last, Wario. Get it? Dead last? And the boo board? Yo! <laughs> well, don't count on saying it that way. Because this crowd is full of crafty types. I mean, hee <laughs> anything could happen. And now it's time for the last five turns roulette. My personal favorite. Here's my lovely assistant. Hee <laughs> Wario. We got Wario lovely. Okay. Uh, if that's your thing, then that's your thing. Oh, the star present! Are you serious? The star present? That's spooktacular! All the stars that used to cost 20 coins are now free! Hey, hey, now that's a bargain! And this ends our last five turns event for the game. Now hang in there, flesh puppets! You're not all bad! <laughs> I like my girls' flesh puppets. It's like how we call us meat puppets. Or you're just like leaving the meat. Meat house? Meat puppet universe? I don't know. When he went to live in virtual reality. I guess he had to be there. <laughs> uh, let's see. We're gonna go knock it a three. Okay. We're gonna deactivate Pink Boo. If we don't get the locomotive, I will be stinking angry. I almost said, like, I don't want to say dirty wordy, but like it sounded like for a split second. Mega Mushroom. I could use the mini. Uh, but I passed the locomotive, though. This is very important to me, as you can plainly tell, because I keep on talking about it. God stinking darn it! Ugh! Wario, why do you gotta ruin things for me? I need the locomotive in my life! Oh, uh, if we show off the- that'd be weird if we show off the happening space for this board, but not the locomotive. Ugh, I'm the only one who cares about this thing, but still, like, the fact that I keep on talking about it, that means it needs to happen! Huh! It's on the last five turns, I don't even care if it's me anymore, I just need to get it happening, reverse a bomb. Let's reverse a boo, let's get Wario out of here, messing everything up. <sighs> Reverse the bomb, you know how it works. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. I'll take the lead. Danger, 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 danger. Start. That, and that, and that, and that, and that. I'm just so happy that this minigame is enjoyable to play. And it's quiet, and enjoyable, and peaceful. And characters aren't obnoxiously screaming every time they hit a button. Be like, yeah! Ah! Yeah! Oh! Yeah! Yeah! Oh my god, Mario Party Top 100, why are you so terrible? Why are you the worst thing in existence? I don't understand it. How you can mess that up so stinking badly? Ugh, whatever. Daisy Peach won. I wish there was an actual Mario Party collection, just like the original Mario Parties, 1 through 8, the Hudson 8, on Switch. Nothing's changed about them. We just put them all in one disc for your convenience. Enjoy. That would be great, but unfortunately not, because we can't have nice things. Last four turn, Luigi, get a two, cause he's dumb. <laughs> now let's see, what's going on over here? Uh, I would have passed the locomotive, okay. But I could go ahead and do this mini mushroom event that we very rarely get to see. Just go over here. Meow, 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 meow. My cat, apparently. Uh, got a four. Go up, actually, where's the star? Oh, he's over there. Ah, darn it, go over there then. Uh, welcome to my rhythm and boo. Just follow me as I play this piano. Just the note, just all the notes, play all the notes I do. Jesus Christ, I can't speak. Hit the right notes and I'll give you more coins each time you do. If you hit the wrong notes or take too long, you won't win as many coins. Would you like to play? Sure. Now follow along. Uh, I don't remember how this control works. Z! That tripped me up. Way to go! I'll give you 18 coins. Whoa, those vigorously fall down. My god, my controller vibrated like crazy. Come again, hee hee hee. Uh, the Z thing threw me off. I was like, cause Z never gets used. To be like, squiggle the control stick or something like that. And battle gain, great. Uh, at least I'm control of what we play. 15! No, 5. Lame. Very boring. Uh, I've had enough of you, Chain Chomp. Let's go over to this one then. Played this one already, I believe, so we need to explain it again. 
I love the boo noise, so stinking cool. It's funny that like it's Bowser's voice just sped up uh, super quickly from Mario 64, which is also really interesting. Um, up here in the top right. You can't beat me in the desert, I'm the queen of Sarasa land. Uh, did I take the easy way? Uh, sort of easy. And I fall as soon as I say that. Sometimes it's like, yeah, because you can get the Luigi or Wario one where it's like very long and drawn out. Uh, this was the easier path, but I seem to be failing anyway. Uh, let's go to the right this time. To the right, to the right. Uh, okay. And I got the crummy one. Just go over here. And we're good. And we're seriously good. I'm just going to stand here awkwardly. What, you thought I was joking? Oh, wow, Luigi's just like a stinking inch away from the finish line. That's funny. But I won. Hooray! Uh, let's see, you got very chump change, because very chump change battle game. And what else? We have? Did it just say results in the back? That I, I like never noticed that. It just says results, 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 results. It's like I was in charge of designing a wall. Like, uh, I might have to choose the paint uh, color scheme or something like that. Oh, wait. Uh, or if I had to design a sign or something, I just wrote sign on the sign, like, yep, it's a sign. It's like a- oh, we're playing another battle game, my god. It's like how, uh, there's a lot of Japanese, uh, shirts, it's just like, it just says shirts or something like that. And hey, this game, I like this one. I don't know, make any sense, I just know that we're playing another battle game. And I'm so stinking angry that the locomotive thing isn't happening. It hurts my soul, makes me want to play the boo, boo board again, or something like that. Basically, you just ride a Boo uh, Locomotive Express and he takes you to certain locations and he can like move other people along the board. Like anyone you pass joins you on the train and uh, you could go to the places that you aren't normally allowed to go to because the bridges are out. It's really fun and cool and that place like a little tune and Daisy does her weird little arm thing where her arm is just up and she's like massaging Boo's head and stuff. I just wanted to see that. It's part of the Mario Party experience for me and you're taking it away from me. It's my stinking birthday and you do this to me. I can't. Oh my god. I'm just so sad. 89. 69! Yeah, Peach! Uh, at least I got that for my birthday. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm... I don't understand why I am upset. Oh, yeah, it just says battle game results. Alright, at least it's a bit more creative. And Luigi gets a coin. And Peach is just frozen in time, I guess. Okay. I don't know. Like, I'm the most innocent LP in the world, apparently. And, yeah, I'm obsessed with 69s. I don't really get it. But what evs? Uh, Peach gets an item. Are we an item? Wow. Okay, I guess it wouldn't be a boo board with a boost crystal ball, so I'm glad you got that. Is there any way to activate the locomotive within, like, the next few turns? Because Peach is about to hit it, so I want her to get it, but she's not going to because reasons. The only one who cares about this, and this is going to be the super awkward board where I just talk about things that don't happen. And again, I guess that's every board because I talk about whatever the heck I want in games that have nothing to do with what I'm talking about. What if? Let's see if I can do better in dungeon duos, because that was like a catastrophe. Even though I won, it was just like, what is controls? What are games? I don't understand how video games work. It's not like I've been doing this for my entire existence. There we go, that's more like it. And okay. I'm going, just run forward. And in case you're wondering, no, you can't jump above it. In case it gets like low enough, it doesn't work. It's like an invisible wall until proven otherwise. Here. And okay. Uh, next one's the Y button, but we're just probably gonna get to it before me, so I don't have to worry about it for now. Just keep on going. And gonna make it! Yeah! Do not mess up this time, thank you. And... There we go! Let's see if we can beat our record. Maybe, possibly. So I'm actually doing somewhat decent this time around. Very little things to talk about when you're mashing. And then the luck of the draw one. What the fruit, Luigi? Uh, let's see, this one? Of course. Come on, Luigi, come on. Thank you. Go in. God, I hate you. I hate you so much, Luigi. 
Uh, it was that one, Luigi. Get in there. Yeah, buddy. And it's not going to be a new record, but we're at least going to win the thing. I don't know what Mario and Peach are doing right there. Wow, they're having a really difficult time with this. There you go, Wario. Someone finally got it. And can we do it before they show up to the Hot Air Balloon segment? Even though it doesn't really matter, I just like to enjoy all the little victories in life because it makes me feel better about myself. And that Bowser statue with the glowing eyes looks really creepy, I just realized. And wow, I never saw it freeze right there. They're stuck in the pipe together. Okay. Probably very cramped and stuff. <laughs> Luigi Daisy won, and we're celebrating, hooray. 10 corns, Luigi is dead last. I like I was just thinking of money I have. I wish I could actually use it for something, but no. Uh, let's see, what do we got, what do we got, what do we got? Last three turns, Luigi, can you be my bud and get to like the uh, pink area? No, you're not even close. Uh, he gets himself a mini mushroom. Daisy, I got nothing. That's the only pink boo station. Oh wait, could I somewhat get it? I have a chance. I have a chance, guys! It's a very slim, stinking chance, but I have a stinking chance to get Peach her stinking locomotive. Or Wario! Okay, I don't have to worry about just Peach getting it then. Or Wario might use the Mega Mushroom, might mess up my plan. Oh, this is like the ultimate goal. Like, I know I'm gonna win the board, but now the real challenge is going to be activating the locomotive. I need a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. Huh. Let's see what I could do. A 3. Uh, into the lottery, I guess. Whatever. Uh, I can't, uh, do the 69 thing again. Uh, can I do 69 rotations before the ball pops out? One, two, three, four, five. No. Oh, I got blue, though. Oh, not so good, but you did win third prize. Take your mushroom and vanish. Yay. Wow, I got three different colored mushrooms here. It looks really cool. But come again, I need the business. <laughs> That's a very funny line. Oh, uh, sorry, three. Something's gonna happen. This is not the last turn, right? Okay, cool. I still got time. He's gonna use the Mega Mushroom. Come on, get a crummy roll, Wario. I need you to get a crummy, crummy roll. Come on, I know you can do it. You're the master of dough missing. Come on. Okay, small roll, small roll. Three, five. That's enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, good. I have a chance. I have a chance. I have a stinking chance to do this. One of you is gonna get the locomotive. I am, unless Wario gets a one on the last turn, that'd be funny. Uh, oh, okay, so it's not gonna be Peach. Wario, I'm doing this for you, buddy. Alright, so I just need to get a very good roll next turn. Activate, or deactivate the pink booze, and then we'll be good to go. I'm the only one who cares about this, but it's the mini victories in life. We need to show it off. It's gonna happen. Just you wait. Oh my god, I'm so sick and excited. I would've been really, I would've been really disappointed if, like, that didn't happen, because, like, I'm always, like... It's weird with Mario Party because like I don't have an option to uh, show certain things off. It's just a matter of whether or not I get to go there or not. I could like play multiple boards and just make sure that everything gets shown off or I could just talk about it. But no, I want to be able to show them off like just uh, normally and stuff. And I may actually be able to do it because I'm strategizing towards it. Who cares about getting the stars or anything like that or the happening spaces? No, I want to get the stinking locomotive. Someone take a drink for a drink of booze. <laughs> For every time I said locomotive in this singing board. Oh, and I don't even know if that's what it's called. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so singing dumb. But you'll get to see it and enjoy all of its glory. I wish Daisy would get to ride the locomotive. Wait, maybe I will, because we got two turns left. And if I just get two really good rolls, nah, it's probably not good enough. But we could still try, I guess. Maybe, possibly, I don't know. Oh, we'll, we'll just have to wait and see. Maybe something will happen. Who knows? Maybe Bowser's Shuffle will show up and then just make everything better. 19 corns and a bunch of seals in the background. Jeez. Got that taken care of. Almost at 200 coins. My god. Oh boy. The ultimate victory. Wario, if you use your mini mushroom and get a 1, I am hashtag resetting so stinking hard you will not even blink. I don't know. Uh, let's see, three. Got a three. I'm gonna waste another turn with a battle game. Not waste a turn, but still, it just takes forever to go through them. And we've seen all the battle games already, so I don't really care. 
Okay, I kind of care when it's a 50 coin battle, even though Luigi doesn't have enough coins for it. Oh, thank God for not choosing Bowser's Bigger Blast. Jesus Christ. Oh, that would have been epic, but I do not want to experience that. At least I have uh, somewhat of a chance of winning this with actual skill. Oh, that always freaks you out, because, like, they pull up their rods before it actually vibrates, so I'm like, oh, I need to press it now! But no, they did it beforehand, it just confuses me. Thankfully, that didn't actually happen, though. Or, well, thankfully it did happen, but I didn't get messed up by it, is what I'm trying to say. It's weird seeing two third place people. Uh, get a buttload of corns, I'm definitely above 200 now. And I get the pity coin, yay! 